With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Question is two boys are holding a horizontal rod of length L and weight W through its two ends. If now one of the boys suddenly leaves the rod, what is the instantaneous reaction force experienced by the other boy? So we can see here, suppose this is our, let's say rod, now here weight acting at its center at distance L by 2 here, let's say is, let's say in the downward direction. And here we have been asked to find the instantaneous reaction. So we can see here, this is, let's say on the one, let's say here corner at its end this here exerting a normal reaction n this w here can be said as mass of the rod is suppose m so m into we can say as g so here total length of the rod is given to be l so we can see here this let's say accelerates downward here center of mass will have acceleration in the downward direction since this rotates about this fixed point with an angular velocity given here as let's say alpha so we can see here the pseudo force acting here will be in the upward direction given here as m into acm so here we can see by translate equation we have here as normal plus pseudo force that is m into acm will be equal to the weight that is equal to mg so the normal reaction here comes as in terms of let's say weight this m can be written as w by g so this comes as w minus here is our w by g into we have here as acm so here to calculate the value of normal reaction we need to find the value of acceleration of the center of mass now about this hinge point let's say point o we can write here second law of let's say newton's second law of motion that is tau is equal to we have here as i alpha so here the torque of this normal reaction will be zero the torque of the weight w about let's say here its center will be equal to w into we have here as l by 2 will be equal to moment of inertia of this rod of mass m about its end point we know here is equal to ml square by 3 and we can say here that acm will be equal to our r alpha so acm will be equal to r alpha hence alpha here can be written as acm divided by we can say as r where r will be equal to let's say this distance that is we can see here this distance that is let's say this will be moving in its circular path of radius r as let's say half the length so this center of mass will be moving in a circle of radius half its length that is l by 2 so substituting the value here we can say alpha as let's say 2 acm divided by we have here as l now here we can see this l square and this cancels out so here we have value of acm as we can say this comes out to be our 3 by let's say 4 of w divided by and say as m so this value is our let's say acceleration of center of mass where w by m we have here as g so this comes as 3 by 4 of g now substituting the value here so this comes as w into we can say as 1 minus here this becomes 3g divided by 4 into g so here this comes as 1 minus 3 by 4 is 1 by 4 hence the let's say instantaneous reaction experienced by the other boy is w by 4 hence w by 4 is our answer for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today